Hi, this is Paul Fackers, Good News Podcast, speaking to Chef Eric Hawaii. Hi, Chef, how are you? I'm great, how are you? Okay, good. Whole foods, eating healthy. Eating healthy. Good news, I love it. It's great news, and it's some of the oldest news in history, but people are just starting to really get back into this idea of eating whole foods, eating naturally, eating what I call low on the food chain, and eating foods that are pure natural, and eating foods that are pure natural, and trying to eat within the seasons and the cycles and the cycles of nature and the cycles of the year. And what's so interesting is that now the fashion and beauty and skincare industry is kind of picking up on that idea and there's a beautiful relationship now between these foods and some companies that are making skincare products. Such as? Such as a brand called Define that uh, you can buy at places like CVS. And Define makes these great products that are made out of 180 different types of food. They have no animal protein. Did you take this home? They're great. Fantastic. Yeah. I have one of these B fine in front of me right now, okay? Which one? And a neck cream. Okay. Okay, listen to this. With mushrooms, iris flower, and, uh, and caffeine. Mm-hmm. Okay, so uh, let's talk about this one because okay. I'm 58 and my neck seems to be a little uh, relaxing. relaxing a little bit, okay? Mm-hmm. So, so similarly, my brain is as well. <laughs> but that, that happened much earlier. Oh. <laughs> uh, caffeine will help you with that. <laughs> okay. So tell, tell me, so so I don't eat this, right? You don't eat it. If okay. you accidentally taste it, in, yes. you'd be fine. It doesn't hurt you. So then you put it on my, I put it on my neck. I haven't done it yet. Uh-huh. And, and what is, I mean, these seem to be, uh, I'm a naturalist. I'm a guy, for all my 50 years, I'm a, a, a nature person. I started Nature Series on PBS. I'm very nature oriented and believe in, you know, I mean, uh, aspirin is from a willow tree and all these uh, things. So it, it told, makes total, so how are they able to, first of all, how are they able to take these kinds of things? They mush them up and they put them into something? Yeah, I mean, they're extracts of all of these different ingredients. You know, they can be kind of, in, in lab situations, they can extract the really important vital stuff from them. You know, mushrooms have great healing properties and are a great cancer and tumor fighter and have been used medicinally in Asia for thousands and thousands of years in traditional Asian medicine. Mm-hmm. Um, so the mushrooms are really important and therefore that they're very healing. Um, they promote great um, sort of cellular turnover, regen- rejuvenation. Um, irises also have great healing properties to them. And um, the caffeine in there actually helps to kind of tighten up that skin that may not be so tight anymore that's getting loose. So all of those things in combination work in this neck cream to really help you out. You know what it is? For me, who, who, who's really into nature kind of things and, and, and flowers and planting and blah, 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 you know, iris is a really a, 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 a it goes wild. It goes, it, it really takes over in a good way because they're gorgeous flower, right? Yeah. Yeah. So, you know, some of these things, if, I believe we're at one anyway, and, and DNA is proven, Watson and everybody's proven that the tree has about 80% of the same DNA as us. So we're all part of nature. So you got the guy who's believer in all this, okay? And so with that in mind, you know, the, the, the mushroom is my, uh, my uncle. So, uh, um, and I really literally believe all these kind of things. So um, it seems to make good sense. It makes great sense. And you know, it, it also just comes from uh, this natural evolution of what people have done since the beginning of time, which is take these products and not only eat them, but use them to make their own health care, beauty, medicine, skincare products. Mm-hmm. And, you know, mushrooms have been used medicinally, like I said, for thousands and thousands of years. Ginger, which turns up in this toner product, also medicinally used for thousands of years. You mentioned willow bark a minute ago, right? Mm-hmm. Willow is where salicylic acid comes from, which is, of course, as we know, aspirin. That's right. what aspirin is. So, right. you know, this is just a way of kind of taking that traditional knowledge, taking these foods, putting it all into beautiful packaging that you can access easily. Maybe you don't have access to all of these great live food products, but you can go out and you can buy something like this. Ah, the company behind it. I mean, I'm really into this. So the company behind it are uh, naturalist type of people, obviously. Mm-hmm. The woman who started it, Lauren Stender, believes absolutely the same way that you and I believe about nature, that we're all one big organism and we're all dependent on each other, you know? So if I'm eating really well and eating really healthy, I'm part of this healthy organism and this healthy, you know, larger thing that we all 
encompass, you know, whereas if you're eating the junk food and the pizza and you're smoking and all that, it's like you're hurting yourself and you're hurting the planet. Oh, uh, God, yeah, our motto here is all we are is what we are for each other. Exactly. Allergen-free fragrance, uh, para, para, uh, paraben-free, right. which is uh, uh, yeah. by far important, and right. vegetarian proteins. Vegetarian proteins, right. And, you know, it's not just these bee products, too. You're actually seeing this turn up in other places. It's very interesting. There's a fashion designer named Norma Kamali. She I love Norma. She's my friend. Well, this is her line of olive oil that we have out of Oh, is that right? Norma makes olive oil now. She oh, I heard it. that. Yeah. Yeah, so she's making i got to call Norma. She's wonderful. Give her a call. She's, <laughs> she's definitely in New York, and she does such good things over here at the... Uh, at the high school uh, and with the National Arts Club, who are our partners over here. Okay. Norma's a, she's for first rate, good, kind, giving, loving soul. Well, she's taken, you know, sort of everything she's accomplished from the fashion world and turned it into creating this amazing olive oil from her own growth. She has olive oil products. You know, it's amazing stuff. And then, you know, we have some other things out on the table here, too. Are you a sardine lover? Oh, I love sardines. Me, too. I love sardines.
uh, grandfather, 97 years old, okay. sardines, uh, cigar, and Schlivowitz. <laughs> <laughs> and a sun reflector. People in California have the same problem. They, I've, I've done stories on it. Yeah. So Even out there, they don't get enough of it. Maybe your grandfather with his reflector was on to the right side. <laughs> <laughs> well, you always look good. <laughs> and you know, a little bit of alcohol, too, every day is a great thing. I'm, I'm, I would definitely believe a shot of alcohol uh, is very good. You know, there's bacteria in us. It's very healthy to, yeah. to give those guys a, you know, a good time. Right. It's a perfect idea. Nice red wine. Yeah. I love it. It's all good. All right, Erica, thank you, and a happy holiday time. Take care.